All right, guys, welcome back to study plot data structure day five problem two. This is an interesting question. Come on, what's an efficient algorithm that search for a value target in an M multiplicated and integer matrix? This matrix has the following properties integer in each row are sorted from left to right. The first integer of each row is greater than the last integer of the previous row. So, for example, one this is our matrix. We will search for the target tree. Tree is in target in, is in matrix, so it's in row. For the example, two is searching for the target thirteen. It's not in the matrix, so it's all false. Let's see how we can do it. Let's let's do it with a binary search. So the time complexity should be big O log. Of let's make an equal of the of the number of the rows and n equal to the number of columns, and that's it. The space complexity should be constant. This is time. This is space. Okay, let's see how we can do it. Let's imagine that this is one big array in one dimension. So the the mid the middle of this array is the 5 index so it's 11 and now let's let's compare the middle by the target the middle is bigger than the target so if we move this this array here to be here okay let's make this left and this is right so we move to right until the middle minus 1 now we have this array 1 3 5 7 10 we compare again the middle of this array with our target the middle is 5 5 is bigger than our target, so again we move the right to be in the middle minus 1. So now we have this small array 1 and 3. We compare the we compare the 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 middle by our target again. I do track or um, I don't know what's this operation name, but I do this operation. So it, the middle it will be 1. 1 is smaller than our target so in this case we move the left so now we have this array that contains just one element three now we compare this element with our target it's equal so we'll soon true if we don't find any any match and the left is will be bigger or equal than the right in this case we return false okay i hope this makes sense to you now to calculate the 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 number of row and number of columns to do this binary search the row is simply should be the mid this operation between the mid and number of columns okay for and the for the columns it will be mid modulo number of columns okay now let's go this we need first left and right to write it just the length of the matrix multiplicated by the length of the column of the matrix minus one now while the left is smaller or equal than our right in this case let's calculate the middle mid equal to left plus right minus left okay now if now let's calculate okay let's make if okay let's calculate the the row and the column the row should be uh let's see we said mid and number of columns and the columns should be mid modulo number of columns okay now if our targets equal to matrix row and call in this case we return true otherwise if our targets is smaller than matrix row and call let's mimic that in this case if the target is smaller so in this case we update the left let me check if the target is smaller in this case we update the right the right should be equal to the mid plus one 
and the final case we update okay i should focus more let's equal to mid plus one and finally it's return false let's run the code yes i mean targets And let's submit. Okay, I hope this video was useful for you and see you soon hopefully. Ciao.